today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to do the, enable the root user on Mac. Very simple and easy to do. What you want to do to start off, just go up to the top left corner where you see the Apple icon. Click on that and then just click on System Preferences. That will open up all your settings. Once you're in here, you want to go to where it says Users and Groups. Once you're in the Users and Groups area, you just want to click on the lock at the bottom of the screen. And you'll have to put in your password, so you can go ahead and do that. Once your password's put in, just unlock it. And then you'll have access to the login options right here. You want to go ahead and click on login options. And then at the very bottom, it'll say network account server. Click on join. Here, you'll have this pop up right here. You just want to click on open directory utility. And then here, we'll have to click on the lock again just to unlock it so we can make changes. Put your password in again. And then click on modify configuration. Then what you want to do once you're in here is just go to the very top where it says directory utility and just find where it says edit and then just click on enable root user it's going to ask you to create a password for the root user so you can go ahead and put one if you would like and then verify it one more time and click on ok this will then enable the root user so when you're going to turn off your mac and log back in you will see another option that says other beside your normal account if you just click on that it'll ask for a username and a password now the username will always be root so r-o-o-t just type in root and then the password that you put in and then you'll be able to open up that username whenever you restart your mac and log into that user and uh, to remove the root user and delete it it's the same way we just did here except once you come to this point you just click on edit and then you'll be able to click on disable root user here and then it will be changed back to normal anyhow i really hope i was able to help you guys out with showing you guys how to enable the root user on mac os if this video helped you out be sure to leave a like on it and subscribe for more thanks for watching